In two of the poorest districts in Bangladesh, women are encouraged to make the decisions that affect daily life. This planning meeting is part of a World Bank program that reaches about two million people in more than 1,000 villages. The sort of issue these meetings address, should the villagers build a solid bridge to the local school? Sabina Yasmin is a student getting ready for final exams. We have great problems in going to school. There is no bridge on the river and we have to cross the canal by using bamboo made bridge. Road conditions are very poor. It is not just that the future of the bridge will be decided locally. It is that 80 percent of the people in these decision-making groups are women. And women have traditionally been left out of business and leadership roles, so tapping their potential is important. Hence the name of the program, Natun Jibon or New Life. Uh, you are actually really tapping into all the resources which are human resources, which are financial resources, which are in internal capacity and internal skills, and you're contributing to the village or the community development in at least 10 or 20 times more than a normal program can contribute. And I think that is, that is what is going to lead to the economic growth of the country. Things are certainly changing at the village level. Shuli Begum sits on her village's committee. In the future, I really want to send my daughter to school. This is something I definitely want, and now we are capable of doing these things. Girls' secondary school enrollment now exceeds that of boys, and as many girl babies as boy babies are surviving infancy. The World Bank project here has also helped create 18,000 small savings and credit groups, relatively small amounts of money that, committee member Morsheda Akhtar Mili says, add up to big projects. We want to earn money by cultivating fish in the least ponds of our village. We also want to establish a grocery complex through our organization from which each of us can buy our required items. Despite the gains, these women in Bangladesh are still catching up. Women's participation in the labor force is low at 26 percent. And because of fear for their safety, some women are hindered in their access to markets and public spaces.